Hi, it's Tony Taylor from Gas Monkey Garage. Now, I'm standing outside our world famous headquarters here in Dallas, Texas. Now what I'm going to do today is take you behind the scenes to an area that most people don't get to see over on the energy side. And that's where we keep some different cars that are unique. I've got one in particular I'm going to show you today. And it's going to be what I refer to as my top pick. So that's going to be Tony's T-Tops for Tony's Top Picks. And this episode is brought to you by our good friends from Haviland. If you'll take a few minutes, come with me. I'll show you a cool car. You might even learn something. So this is a 944 Turbo 1987 model. It was one of the final oh, evolution, if you will, of the 924 that came out in 1977. Many of you that are my age, you remember this car growing up. It was kind of the poor man's Porsche, if you will. The 911 was out of the reach of most people back then. And when this car came in, it was around $30,000. It wasn't cheap by any means. Uh, but certainly more affordable than the 911 was to the average Joe out there. Now, the Porsche 924 was actually developed by Porsche for parent company Volkswagen. Uh, Volkswagen, Porsche, Audi uh, worked together developing and cross-developing uh, cars for each other. The 924 was actually developed as a replacement for the Volkswagen Beetle. But when time came to replace it, the, that was way too much car to replace the Beetle. Volkswagen went with a Rabbit. Porsche had all this money invested, so hence they came to market with the 924. This particular version here is extremely rare in that it only has 1,600 miles. Now that's probably bar none the lowest mileage in any privately owned Porsche. Privately owned meaning if you go to the museum in Stuttgart, they probably have one that has less miles there. But you'll never find one that's out or available or for sale. Which is why when the opportunity came up for Richard to buy this car, we had to act quick to get it. So this is the holy grail, if you will, of Porsche 944 turbos. This particular model was one owner, well cared for, it was in the garage, still has the original tires, driven very lightly, cared for throughout the years, um, and therefore it's a very rare car. We'll get the engine bay detailed, make sure everything's 100% on it, do all the fluids, filters, get the service up with Haviland products. We'll have this ready to go to a big auction, probably Pebble Beach and uh, hopefully we'll set a new mark for 944 turbos. We'll let you know about that on a future episode of Tony's T-Tops. Again, that's brought to you by our good friends at Haviland, and Tony's T-Tops are Tony's top picks. T-Tops, see how that works? Thanks for tuning in, and uh, we'll get back to you with another episode coming up soon. Thank you very much.